Hello, Ho Chi Minh City. I am Pietro Porro from Milano, Italy, and I ride in my bike uh, since uh, 10 months, and uh, I drive for 40,000 kilometers. Ciao, sin ciao. The, the final of August of 2015, me and my friends, we rode um, uh, our bike for um, um, five or four days uh, in Italy and we stop in uh, close to the sea one night and we thinking about the future, the, um, the ideas we had for our um, I don't know for our project and uh, maybe we, we need to find something new and uh, I had this book in my pocket that is uh, Giorgio Bettinelli book that uh, I will always uh, show this book because it's my inspiration and uh, this man make uh, in 1992 the uh, from Rome to Saigon. When you speak about this kind of things, uh, the next day you forget or you, I don't know, maybe it's, yes, I come back to my job, uh, it's not possible, but in that time it was different. Maybe because the motivation of ourselves was uh, um, more intense, and so we decide to write a project. I don't need to arrive in Saigon. Sometimes you need to put your uh, final destination to make something and this was the symbol so this book but the real motivation was inside me my father i think until the the mm, um, the last days when I stay in Italy, so you speak again about this trip, but why wow, it's it's crazy thing ah like this uh, no my mother was uh, ah are you sure you uh, um, uh, how much time you go outside from Italy too much and uh, I want to see you but every day you need to call me because I, I want to to hear your voice that you feel good yes okay don't worry don't worry and after that um, both of my parents, so my mother and my father, was very uh, support me. My my base, my yes, was very helpful. So, anzi, grazie mamma, grazie papà. In Italy, we say, uh, <laughs> l'amore non è bello se non è litigarello. The love is not good if you don't fight a little bit with your partner. My Vespa, my star, Arancona is the name. Arancona, that means orange thing. Oh. Okay, because it's orange. She have a lot of problem in this trip, since the beginning. Uh, every day, little bit, I need to regulate something from the carburetor or have big problems some period, so I need to take care every day. I think that sometimes when I meet some girls maybe have a problem after when I need to start because they, she is jealous. It's jealous, very jealous. Yes, yeah, so I like, I love this bike but I ate this bike sometime and I was very boring about a lot of problems. I didn't pass more than two days without my bike. I need to cross Myanmar and Thailand and they change the regulation uh, for the travelers and so I need to produce a lot of documents I, I didn't know how can cross this border that borders those borders and um, I passed like three months in India trying to know how how go forward after India the first part of this period was winter so cold in Delhi I was alone because my friends uh, decided to divide our road and so uh, he went to Nepal, so I was alone to, to try to solve this problem and you know a big city, you, was, you are a foreigner and nobody take care about me, you know? so I was alone completely. So it was difficult. Two weeks before that moment in Pakistan and uh, the last part of Iran because I have problem with my engine and I need to cross Pakistan very fast because uh, in the beginning uh, you cross in the south of uh, Iran, go to Pakistan and you need to stay with the police all the time. 
with a military escort. You can go alone. So you go with the people with rifle and uh, in the desert and you need to go fast, follow him, follow them. Oof, it's very painful. No, Sometimes I put my Vespa on pickup of police because I, I couldn't drive. So this was very difficult moment. But all in all those moments I never think about that I, uh, I will come back or I will stop my trip. The problems are not only one by one. It's all together. In the middle of this trip, I take uh, eight days. I stayed close to the border between India and Myanmar. And I stay in this room for eight days, only sleeping, writing, eating, only this, relax. Beginning, uh, I had uh, friends bring me from city to other city and give me contacts, the other Vespa man in the other city. And so it was like a free tour, but guided tour, by like a um, tour Vespa club to Vespa club uh, was uh, very interesting. I love Oyan, very, very nice city. Also Quion, because a lot of people don't know Quion, Quion. but my friends live there and it's very quiet and nice city. And I visit a very good uh, coffee shop of my friends, it's Dean Cafe. And also handicapped people work in the coffee shop and to improve the skill to, and also in the, in the shop of this, uh, this place. And, was, and also in this place there are a lot of Vespa, because my friend is uh, passionate about Vespa. So that moment was something uh, special for me because I am a social worker, I work with people who have mental disease, handicapped people. I love Vespa and uh, it's coffee is like uh, something very close to uh, Italian culture and I love coffee. So when I visit this place it was like uh, all my um, things of my life uh, united in one place. My official plan. I don't, I don't have an official plan. So I will try to, to send my bike here in Europe. I take a little trip in Europe and I try to save money for uh, the summer. The, the next winter I want to make a new project.